can see we are at the table today we, because we are celebrating my 100th episode of Just Call Me Sarah. So can we all just give God a Yeah, I tell you what, God, we serve such a, such a good God, and he's so awesome, and he, you know, he'll bring you a long ways, and mm. if, if you walk in obedience to him, you'll see God just open the windows of heaven uh -huh. and pour you out a blessing that you don't even have room enough to receive. Mm -hmm. So I do want to celebrate what God is doing in uh, one of the camera crew, I, one of the camera people I hear, her name is Tiffany. I try to get her to come on the set with me today, but she's working the camera. <laughs> but she kept on saying, Miss Andy, you know your 100th uh, episode is coming up. And I said, really? And so she reminded me, you know that 100, you know, like, okay, let me, let me do something to celebrate this. So mm. I thank God for it. I couldn't invite everybody that I wanted to invite, but I'm so happy today to have Apostle Head again. Braille. Pastor Cynthia Cannon. Oh, yeah. Uh, Miss Brand Minister Brandy Fair. <laughs> yeah, my, my spiritual granddaughter. <laughs> my spiritual son, Patrick Styles. Yeah. And none other than my good looking husband. <laughs> <laughs> the star. <laughs> <laughs> but you know they love they call you the star here and it just call me Sarah. What can I say? There you go. <laughs> just go ahead and receive it. Just go ahead and receive it. Amen. Right. Praise God. <laughs> I do have a scripture that I want to share tonight. And so I was praying about what scripture that I should share. And the Holy Spirit gave me Psalms 100 since it's my 100th show. Amen. 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 And it reads, Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands. Mm -hmm. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord, he is God. It is he that has made us and not we ourselves. Amen. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Enter to his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him and bless his name. For the Lord is good. Yes. Can somebody bear witness with yes. me? Yes. For the Lord is good. Amen. His mercy is everlasting. Yes. And his truth endures to all yes. generations. Yes. Oh, my God. What a, what a powerful word from God. Yes. What a powerful word from God. What a powerful word from God. So I just, I know I just want to thank God because, you know, when the Holy Spirit led me to, to uh, start my own Just Call Me Sarah talk show, you know, I was just sitting at home and it had been prophesied to me over and over again over the years that uh, you're going to have a Just Call Me Sarah talk show. You're going to be on television. Mm. And then one day the Holy Spirit said, it's time. Yeah. It's time. How many know you got to wait on God's oh, time yeah. for yeah. everything? Mm -hmm. And so I came out here and my husband and I, and we talked to Ben Payne and, you know, and we just believed God. We just believed God for this time and this has been like five years ago when that came about mm -hmm. but God is a keeper yes, he is. he's a way maker mm -hmm. and I'm surrounded you know how the Bible said we are surrounded by a great cloud of witnesses yeah. well I'm telling these people out here the, um, the camera crew mm -hmm. Ben Payne Dante Allison mm -hmm. everybody that works here they are super Phenomenal in God, yeah. and I couldn't ask. I, I promise you all, I mm -hmm. could not ask for a better group of people to work with. Mm -hmm. I give God all the praise for that. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm gonna start with um, Brandy. You know, Brandy. You know, I, I told you I said I want you to say some good to me. Okay, so first, <laughs> I wanted to start out with a scripture, and okay. it's Ephesians 9 and 11, and it says, the race is not given to the swift, but to the ones that endure to the oh, end. Wow. And although this is not the end, this time is just a grand celebration to celebrate your 100th show. Yes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 
I just wanted to encourage you because some people don't even make it to their fifth show. Yeah. But this is 100. This is like the big one O. Like, yeah. oh my goodness. <laughs> And I am just so happy for you. And I think and I praise God for you because Just Call Me Sarah is just something awesome, like legitimately awesome. Yeah. How you educate people, you encourage people every Monday night. Oh, oh my God. God. Every Monday night. It's just awesome. And I just absolutely love it. I love you. I, love I thank you. God for the joy love. that you have in your heart. And your joy is contagious. Yeah. You know, you know how like when you see somebody yarn and then the next person they yarn yeah. and then it goes on. That's like your joy. Yeah. <laughs> so like COVID is kind of spraying around. Yeah. Yeah. And so I just wanted to encourage you to keep on keeping on the good work. Thank and it's you, been baby. amazing. And I can't wait to see what else God has in yeah. store for you well, and the well, many shows to come. Thank, thank you, baby. I tell you what, I, I'm going to be like my mama. I, you know, I can't pay you for that, but that was good. <laughs> <laughs> that was real good. And I have my spiritual son, Patrick Styles. I tell you, he's such a phenomenal young man of God. And I am so thankful for the, for the day that God sent him into my life. Mm -hmm. So, Pat, talk to me. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> but I tell you, you are a queen. Mm -hmm. That's the word I think when I see you. I see queen. Mm -hmm. And you have taken your throne here at G WGGS. Mm -hmm with 100 shows man a lot of like she said a lot of shows don't see five shows it's a lot of great sitcoms and a lot of great series that are out right now mm -hmm. that ain't making it past four seasons two seasons yeah. but you had 100 shows mm -hmm. <laughs> that is a <clears throat> that is a testament to the goodness of god yes you know yes. because a lot of people can come on here and mm -hmm. sit down and talk with you but they ain't living and walking like you living and walking. Oh. Because I know within my heart, mm -hmm. I know you living right. Oh. Ain't no shot of, it was a, without a shadow of a doubt in my mind. My I know God is speaking through you. He walks through you. He works mm -hmm. with you. And I know you're obedient to what he tells you to do. And I'm just so thankful <laughs> for you. And I just want you to keep on saying the famous saying that you always say. <laughs> You remember when Miss Haddock started started messing with you on TV? Amen. Praise, praise God. God. <laughs> Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise, praise God. God. If you can't say nothing else, <laughs> if I if I'm if I'm sick in the hospital bed, if I'm if I'm driving down the highway, if 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 I'm locked out my house and I'm mad, if I'm locked out my car, I can still say Amen. Amen. Praise, praise God. God. <laughs> you know why? Because that's who all the glory belongs to. Amen. And we thank you and we celebrate you today. Thank and you, congratulations. baby. Congratulations. Amen. Thank you, sweetheart. Yes, that means so much to me. Yes, it does. It does. And so, husband, husband. what's he going to say to me? <laughs> well, I just want to say you're the hardest. Yeah, look at me. You're the hardest working look woman at me real I good. know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead. <laughs> because you, you work so hard all the time. You know, you're up late at night and, 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 here I am in the bed cutting some Z's and you are working. <laughs> cutting and some I what? Z's. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I just, I admire you for hanging in there before God had given you long ago. And I remember when we first came out here and talked to in pain and all. And, uh, and uh, we knew that God was going to open a door for you here. Yeah. And, and I never doubted that you'd be here as long as you have. And I thank God that I'm being right here by your side every Me step too. of the way. I'm thankful. Oh, I'm thankful yeah. for that. Yeah. 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 I know. Yeah. I know. I know. Real love. That's right. real love. Thank you so much. I appreciate that You're so welcome. much from my heart. You're welcome. And so, Pastor Cannon, you know, you, you're my spiritual daughter. Yes. And I love you so much. I love you. And you've been in my life for so long, mm -hmm. a long time. Yes. But you've always just been who you are. Mm -hmm. And I want to thank you for that. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Amen. <laughs> praise the Lord. Well, I appreciate you. And I just thank and praise God for the, uh, the show. Just call me Sarah there. He <laughs> put in your spirit to bring the fruition. <laughs> and I praise God that it's here and that you have made it 
to 100 episodes because I know that there have been thousands and thousands that have been blessed yeah. from watching Just Call Me Sarah. Thank mm -hmm. you, Jesus. Praise God. Hallelujah. Thank you, and Jesus. I thank and praise God that you address, I want to say you address subjects that other churches and things a lot of times don't address. Wow. You so know? True. And so Christians, sometimes they walk, they walk in a certain darkness, even though they're smart in one area, mm -hmm. but they're in the dark in other areas. Mm -hmm. And you, you be like, let's shed some light on that. <laughs> and, 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 and you know, and I am just so grateful that you do that because mm -hmm. it's sad when, when Chris has got it all, you know, wrapped up, tied up, and everything when it comes to spiritual things. Yeah. But then when it comes to natural things, right. then they, they trip up, they fall, they bump their head, they do everything but the right thing when it comes to those things. Mm -hmm. And so I really appreciate how that you approach, like, just about every subject that can be approached, you Thanks know, God. because we're going to have to deal with it some way, somehow sometime another, and mm -hmm. we might as well learn how to deal with it right. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. So I praise God for just how Ms. Sarah I, um, I'm, I'm super, you know, my heart is overwhelmed right now with joy mm -hmm. and thankfulness right. for what God has done and what he is doing. Mm -hmm. um, Pat, I want to thank you again for letting me be a part of your plays, your productions. Yes, ma'am. Um, I have met some great people that only God knew that I would meet. My mm -hmm. Lord. Um, I have met some great people on Just Call Me Sarah. I have met some great people on Nightline. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like God is just enlarging my territory. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes, yes. He's extending my borders. Mm -hmm. And, I, you know, the word of God says, if you be faithful mm -hmm. over a few things. Yes. yes. That he'll call you to rule over many. Come on here, yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And I want to thank Hallelujah. God too for um, Mr. Kenny Smith. He's, uh -huh. you know, he he's helped me so much, been there My to Lord. support me. And he sings a song called "Out of Your Mind." <laughs> 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 so I want to go to him right now. Amen. <laughs> Everybody 
Wow. Praise God. That, that was Melissa Kenny Smith singing Out of Your Mind. Amen. So, you know, after my 100th episode, my Lord. if somebody at home or somebody here think I ain't going to praise them, Glory. guess what? <laughs> you out of your mind. <laughs> Amen. Amen. I, I remember um, I was on Pastor Benny Presents, and he asked me, he said, well, tell me how to just call me Sarah got started because a lot of people don't know my mm -hmm. story. Amen. But um, when I worked at the hospital, um, one of my members of the church that I pastor, Shepherd's Heart Ministries, mm -hmm. Pastor Erica Goldsmith. Hi, Pastor Erica. <laughs> uh, she said, she called the Greenville News and she said, my pastor is Greenville's best kept secret. Wow. Mm -hmm. And she called the Greenville News and instead of them coming out and doing an interview with me, mm -hmm. they called me on the phone first before they came out and took my picture. Mm. And so they did the interview with me. And so he asked me, he said, how old are you? If you don't mind me asking. So I told him how old I was. I ain't gonna tell y'all though. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm up there. But oh. anyway, he said, you would think someone a lot younger than you would be doing all the things that you do. Mm. So I said, well, just call me Sarah. Because Sarah considered herself past age. Mm -hmm. But she judged God faithful. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Who had promised. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's how Just Call Me Sarah was birthed. Yes. My Lord, hallelujah. Yeah. Because I want somebody to know tonight that age is just a number. Yes. Just a number. Amen. Let God use you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Whatever He wants to do in your life. You don't know how impactful you're going to be. Mm -hmm. You don't know whose life you're going to touch. Yes, yes, yes. And when I stand before God, when mm -hmm. I stand before God, mm -hmm. Amen. Thank you, I want to hear him say, well done. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Amen. My Amen. good, my faithful daughter. Yes, Jesus. So, Apostle, I want to thank God for you today. God bless you. Because you are a spiritual daughter. I know that mm -hmm. when you came into my life and and, and you was going to be ordained as an apostle. Mm -hmm. And Pastor Cannon said, I don't want anybody <laughs> just laying hands on my pastor. That's right. <laughs> Amen. And she called me and she said, would you do it? Mm -hmm. And apostle, I am so thankful mm -hmm. because right. you, you are you're a phenomenal daughter. Thank you. My Lord. I can call you any time of the day or night. You say, I'm here for you. My I'll Lord. be there for you. I'll Thank help God. you any Jesus. way that I can. Mm -hmm. And I appreciate you so very much. And thank and people out here love you too. Oh, Amen. They Thank love you, you too. Yeah. So talk to me. Yes. <laughs> well, I was just delighted, you know, when you asked me to come and be a part. Of, of your 100th celebration. <laughs> Let's give God a praise. <laughs> 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 yes. See, like every time we say 100, it just spontaneously brings a praise mm. yeah. because there's no small milestone. Mm. Yes. Amen. But I remember when God gave you the vision. Yeah. And the scripture that came to me for you was Habakkuk 2 and 2. Yes. Write the vision mm. and make it plain <laughs> so Lord. they that hear it yeah. can run. Mm -hmm. And God gave you the vision of just call me Sarah. First you had the conferences and yeah. I came in and joined in the conferences. Yeah. And then when God gave you the vision to bring it on television. Right. Amen. And you wasn't deterred by anything. Mm -mm. But you were faithful, and you trust God, and you believed God. Oh, yes. Amen. And you ran with it. Yes. And I just want to encourage maybe somebody on TV for just a second. God may have given you a vision. Mm -hmm. Amen. God is faithful to his vision. My yes. Lord. Run with it. Trust God. This woman of God is an amazing example. Mm -hmm. Praise God. Amen. Of what God will yes. do without having television experience that I knew of, <laughs> you know, but you went for it. Yes. And look at it now. Yes. A hundred episodes <laughs> later. <laughs> Amen. Yes. A hundred episodes later, mm -hmm. and you are still going full force. Mm -hmm. And I want to piggyback on what Pastor Cannon was saying. You address issues that other people never thought, I never thought about. In one of my shows, and this is strange to say it's a favorite show, 
but it is the one uh, when the mortician came on oh, and he talked about the burden of the mortician. Yeah. Yeah, and the things that they experience and that people don't pray for them. My and man. I said, that's right, because I've never prayed for a, mar a mortician. Yeah. My God. You know, mm -hmm. and it just like Pastor Ken was saying, it yeah. shines light on areas that other people in the body, we just don't think about. Mm -hmm. Right. You know, but that's one of my prayers. You know, they are in my prayer, especially with the COVID, because mm -hmm. no, no doubt they lost family members. Mm -hmm. They lost neighbors, loved ones. If we were overwhelmed, with instead of it being one or two people every couple of years, you know, they were seeing hundreds, literally hundreds of people. Mm -hmm. So that was just one of the episodes that really rung volumes. Right. And oh. then, but another thing that I love about you, <laughs> what you love? and I love about Just Call Me Sarah, you've given us a platform. Mm. Yes. You've given platform yes. for local ministries yes. and yes. people local to tell, to share their testimony. Mm. Yeah. Like the one just last week or so about the ones that had been delivered from drugs and alcohol. Mm. Yes. And they was able to, to tell, share their testimony, yes. giving other people that are out here struggling mm -hmm. to give them hope mm -hmm. to know that there is help yes. Wow. Yes. and that there is deliverance. Yes. Right. Amen. And that they can come out mm -hmm. of that lifestyle. Yes. And, you know, but just from, like Pastor Ken was saying again, from <laughs> one end to the other, mm -hmm. you know, you have addressed it. Amen. Um, you addressed the women and heart disease. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I was able to be on that episode yeah. and give my testimony yeah. mm -hmm. how God had uh, spared my life, how I went through a heart attack. Yeah. Amen. And the doctors told me, you know, you have a, you had a 1% chance. Mm. Wow. I, well, no, he said you were one minute away, mm, one minute away, wow. but God, but God, you know, and yes. I had a chance to share that testimony, yes. amen, and to encourage other women and men to take care of their heart, mm -hmm. yes. take care of your body, because I was 53, yes. and I had no idea I had heart problems, My yeah. God. but it happened to me, no. so I just want to encourage you and bless you and want to encourage you to keep going mm -hmm. because you will not fail. Amen. Whatever Amen. you put your hand to, God Hallelujah. is going to prosper. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Wow. Thank you, Jesus. I receive, I receive that. Mm -hmm. Praise God. I receive God. everything that you all have said <clears throat> to me today. Praise God. Um, you don't realize this, but you spoke life to me. Mm, praise God. Praise you know, God. strength to me. Thank you, praise Jesus. God. You know, it's good to be surrounded by people mm, yes. that really love you. Amen. And Amen. care about you. Yeah. And want to see you succeed in life yes. and have something. I had so many people when I put on Facebook that I was going to be celebrating 100, my 100 oh, episodes. Wow. People start texting me and, and putting messages to me on Facebook, oh, mm. glory to God. congratulating me, my Lord. praying for you, encouraging yes. my walk in Christ. Praise God. That Amen. meant so much oh, to me. God. You know, Amen. they couldn't be here today, you, but they're here in spirit. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 They're here in spirit. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I just want to thank you for for loving me <laughs> my Lord. and for praying for me Jesus, mm -hmm. and for encouraging me in my walk with Christ and you know and as everybody has said today you know I want just call me Sarah not to be just a talk show mm -hmm. but a ministry yes, mm -hmm. yes. that we can reach out and help somebody else in their walk my Lord with the Lord mm -hmm. yeah. you know we all need that amen we all need somebody to speak life to them mm -hmm. and say yes. you can make it you can you can do what God called you to do yes mm -hmm. you know and one once God puts something in your spirit to do step out be like mm -hmm. Peter and step out the step boat out yes. The yes. Yes. yes when you yes. hear Jesus yes. say come mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. don't be saying is that you yeah that's me come <laughs> <laughs> Come, Amen. come, Amen. because as long as we're stepping out in faith, Amen. we're going to be all right. Amen. Yes. Amen. We're going to be all right. We're going to be all right. We're going to be all right. Mm -hmm. yes. And again, I want to thank Dante Thompson. Amen. Uh, I want to thank Greg West because my show airs also in Atlanta, on Atlanta Amen. Live, thank you. WATC. Amen. So I thank God for him. 
I thank God for when I was here for a while that I was asked to even start hosting Nightline. And, mm-hmm. and I Amen. thought, wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Jesus. Right, you know? right, right. Yes. Yeah. And that has yeah. been phenomenal. Mm. So I give God all the praise for that. So what I would love to do is just close us out in prayer My Lord. today. Uh, we got some good food in the back. We're going to be eating and celebrating. My Lord. And uh, again, I want to thank everybody for, for tuning in to Just Call Me Sarah. Every week, every, we air every Monday at 6 o'clock, mm-hmm. WGGS, Channel 6, 6 or 16, whatever network you have, please tune in. And then also leave me your your comments. Yes. You yeah. know, c- call me on the phone, whatever, message. My Lord, we'll look forward to hear from you. Can we close out in prayer? Yes. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Pastor Cannon, will you close us out in yes. prayer? Thank you for tuning in to this wonderful celebration and God bless. Glory to God. Lord, we just thank and praise you, Lord, for your goodness. Lord God, in your mercy, we thank you, Lord, for this 100th episode, Lord, of Just Call Me Sarah, Lord God. We ask you, Lord God, to just keep on multiplying and multiplying and multiplying the shows, Lord God, in Jesus' name, hallelujah, Mm. multiplying this ministry, Father, in Jesus' name. Lord, just keep on blessing Apostle uh, Broughton and Pastor Broughton, Lord God, that they'll be able to carry this ministry on, Lord God, in Jesus' name, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, God. God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, open doors for them, Lord, with their arms.